Hey you guys, good morning healthy people. I am trying to fit this hat, <laughs> or fit my hair under this hat and it's not working. I always have to have a barrier scarf because I just, again, I'm trying to retain as much length as possible. And um, yeah, so here we go. You guys know I had that little furrow yesterday, so now it's wide. But here we go. Good morning, healthy people. Happy Wednesday, January 13th, 2021. Today is exciting because it is my second episode of Morning Coffee, but that is not what we're doing right now. Right now, we're simply journaling, and the question is, are you courageous enough? So again, I think I told you guys, I always try to get clarity on what we should journal about. Or sometimes I will go to the website when I can't come up with anything. But the word courageous um, has been on my radar for like, I think the last two months now, right? And then someone else mentioned it, you know, when it, when I say it's on my radar, radar, it means that it comes to me in a very specific and clear way. And then people around me begin to mention it often or I see it in places. So it, it's the word courageous. And I'm kind of mixing that um, with another, with something that my sister had mentioned, which was um, she was telling some of her story from uh, a time, a point in time in her life, her uh, one of her adventures, and she basically said she knew it was about an ex, and she knew she should have left, but she didn't. But we know how God works. It, you know, you you going he gonna get you up out of there, especially if he has plans for you, um, regardless of what you want. Um, and so, are you courageous enough? Not necessarily just, not necessarily to leave, but to stay, or to leave, or to wait, or to dare, or to try, or to change. Whatever it may be. So that's what I'm asking you. Are you courageous enough? Because when we think about relationships, they do take courage because it's a risk. You know, um, all relationships, you start a new job, it's a risk. Is this the place I should be starting or should I take that job? Do I quit this job and go to that job? Do I marry this person? Is this a two-year marriage, a three-year marriage, a 20-year marriage, a 40-year marriage, or is this a death do us part? Um, is this a good friend for me? Is this, you know, how are my children going to turn out? Did I pour enough into them? Did I pour enough into them and they still turn out in a different way? So these are just some of the questions that, 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 that you might want to ask yourself. Are you courageous enough to have those connections, to have those relationships, to have the life you desire? Um, that's all that I have for you. I went a little bit over. I apologize. If I wasn't talking about my afro, I wouldn't have taken up your time. But I am wishing you guys healthier, happier habits. That is definitely a question that I am going to reflect on a little bit more um, for myself, 